The Keeping Up With The Kardashians star was evicted from Celebrity Big Brother on Tuesday, days before tonight's finale. Malika almost quit the show last week during a task but decided to stick it out because of her co-stars. And while it seemed the 34-year-old got on well with her fellow housemates, there was something she found very hard. Malika appeared on today's Good Morning Britain to chat to Kate Garraway and Ben Shepard. The reality star said she'd got really good at layering clothes, describing the house as freezing, absolutely cold. It's cold on the outside, it's cold on the inside she said, I come to London all the time. I work in Manchester as well. I was thinking I'll stay in my room, but it's cold on the outside, it's cold on the inside. I had several colds while I was in there. It's hard emotionally but physically as well. The beauty admitted it was the little things she was grateful for after coming out of the house. She told the Good Morning Britain presenters, I was so excited to get into a shower that someone hadn't just jumped out of before I got in I. You miss those things. You don't realize how much you take things for granted until you don't have it. Malika said the experience was quite good for her. Saying, I'm a bit of a control freak and you have to give up your control. I like controlling myself but I think that's being harsher on myself too. So relinquishing control made it a bit easier, mentally. She went on, I didn't have an issue with anyone in the house. I was a little stifled by the structure of Big Brother itself. I'll talk to anyone, but it was really rough, things like. So, I can't shower when I want to? And Malika didn't wait long once she was out of the house to get in touch with best friend Khloe Kardashian. She confessed, it got rougher and rougher but yes, she was one of the very first phone calls when I got out. Malika explained Chloe asked when she was flying back to America. No doubt to stand by her side during her pregnancy. Now, just Shane Jenick, Courtney Act, Anne Widdicombe, Shane Lynch, 